the Ukrainian authorities are now forcing men who have lived Ukraine legally and moved to the European Union to come back to Ukraine and fight. During the Russia-Ukraine war, Ukraine has lost, has suffered about 400 to 450,000 casualties, not mentioning the displaced men. Friends, in short time, uh, I, I don't know what to do. F word. In short, I just received this letter in his hand. Here it is. It has my photo on the paper. I translated it, he says. It says that Ukraine has sent a request. According to the Ukrainian authorities, I entered the territory of the European Union illegally. Although I was traveling legally, he says, I entered legally. I didn't buy any certificates here, he says. I told you how I left. And, and it says here I have I have to leave the European Union within two weeks. I have to leave Europe within two weeks. That's it. Otherwise, I will be forcibly exiled to the territory of Ukraine. Apart from this, the Ukrainian authorities are using every means they have, every trick in the book to make sure they get men to recruit into the armed forces. And that is seriously failing. With the exception of this, they are now appealing to the women in Ukraine who are living simple lives, enjoying themselves to stop partying and then enroll or enlist into the army and go and fight the Russians. My viewers, just look at this woman, simple woman, normal woman. Do you think this woman will last even a day on the battlefield against the Russians? Now they are turning to women. The same women who Zelensky yelled at a few weeks ago in that video where he, you know, saying, hey, you guys are partying in nightclubs and so forth. You're out of partying in, in the middle of like downtown Kiev, like nightclubs and these men and these mostly women. But, you know, uh, we need you now to fight. So these young women who are up partying, uh, we need you to fight. They look fierce. They look really fierce um, on the battlefield. They're going to be really, they're, it's going to be a whole nother world when they're out now being forced to fight. So now Ukraine has released a brand new uh, recruitment video today targeting women specifically. Watch. What is the meaning of this? Where are the feminist groups? Where are the human rights activists? Why aren't they talking against this? Why is everybody quiet? I seriously don't understand. It seems the war in Ukraine is beyond our imagination. It seems we are not really getting the accurate news from Ukraine. I won't say much. All I will say is that leave a comment. If what is happening is right, let me know. Let us know. If it is wrong, let us know.